much fun. This is going to be the worst day of your life. I'm bringing nunchucks. <laughs> I need to hide. Hey guys, what's happening? Uh, my name is Nick Che. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I have a very special video because I'm hanging out with my friend June Park. And right now we're going to be filming a Northwestern dorm room tour. A few of you guys might know that I was actually committed to come to Northwestern, but I always wonder what a dorm room looked like here. So I'm just gonna be going through what a double looks like at Northwestern. This is June. He was actually going to be my roommate when I was coming here, so I hit him up while I was in town. Why don't you tell us about yourself? Hey guys, my name is June. I'm a sophomore right now. I'm studying communication studies, managing a music artist, hey. and uh, that's pretty much it. So we're just gonna break down what June has in his rooms and why, and just give you guys a rundown. All right, guys. So this is June's desk setup. We're gonna be going through his laptop, what he uses to, you know, make music and obviously study. You study a lot in here? I don't study really <laughs> in general, but that's fact stuff. All right, bet. So um. This is my desk setup, this is where the magic happens, the computer, got the laptop, this is where the Logic Pro is, you already know the deal. Hey. Got the keyboard here for the MIDI. Got the speaker, like I said guys, college speakers are essential. Um, I got this, uh, I got the facial moisturizer, you already know. Got I'm I just made a skincare video, bro. Yeah. <laughs> this is a must have. Yes. Chlorof Clorox disinfecting wipes. Hey, we got the collection here though. I relate to that though because I got hella shoes, so yeah, figuring out shoe management is probably the hardest thing in a college dorm room. But let's go over to the, what, common space? Yeah, kind of. Hey, so this is the common space. We got the futon right here. When we have guests over, we actually have somebody staying here now. Um, we got some consoles on the TV setup. We got a Switch going on. We got an Xbox hey, going the on. Whole setup, bro. We got a Nintendo Wii for the true OG. You got the controllers too. Yeah, we got the controllers. Tell us about the bed setup. So, um, yeah, when we first got here, both of the beds were actually lowered, but we wanted to fit this TV in here so that we had to like push them up. We just like did that ourselves with like rocks and like other stuff. Wait, what? So, like, yeah, you just, gotta like, be innovative. Primitive tools, <laughs> that ass. Yeah, and then we just pushed them up so we can have space for the futon underneath and like a TV. I recommend if you're trying to create a common space in a small dorm room that's like a really big Must move have. to push your beds up all right so you guys already know that a common space is meant to hang out with your boys hang out with people who are coming over so like june was saying having a tv having a futon having places where people can just sit down hang out watch a movie grab a drink like that's all very important to have in a fun college dorm room the bed setup is super smart so that you have more real estate like he said there's not enough room to put a tv if you don't raise it up um let's move over to the closets so uh, this is my uh, roommate's wardrobe right now. He just got a couple coat hangers. Getting one of these is really important for a dorm room. Makes Super you fit a lot important. more space if you fold it. We put a drawer down here so it can fit all his actual other stuff. That's super smart. Um, this is my wardrobe. Um, I have it much more packed here because I don't have like as good of a setup as him or like a drawer underneath. So I just kind of hang a lot of my pieces up there. Um, it's really important to make sure you keep like your detergent and your like dryer stuff, your shower stuff above, like find a good space for that. That's normally around your closet. And yeah, that's like kind of the closet space here. Yeah. <laughs> What's this though? Oh yo, this is a rose gold and black. Um, apparently they're super thick. What do you think adding them onto your style, bro? Um, jewelry I think is a great compliment to a lot of fashion. People think that fashion is all about the pieces, but really at a certain point it becomes about the details. Hey. And jewelry is all about the details. That's so. facts. That's a huge fact. You guys already know that I've been saying that jewelry is a super essential part of any guy's outfit. You can have the most expensive clothes, but the details really come down to your accessories. That's why I think rocking a chain, a subtle chain, nothing too flashy, or the simple golden band that they offer is just a really great way to add a little bit more style to your outfit. Jewelry is super important. Like that's something worth investing in. That shit goes up in value. Too. That's true. Like gold is always yeah. going up in value, so it's a good investment if anything. <laughs> hey, Mario Kart. No, yeah, dude. This is honestly this game is fucking insane. So having something like a common area just gives you time to relax, especially after classes or you're getting tired of studying. Playing with your roommate is always a good time to just de-stress. The one hassle that comes with like lofting your bed for this extra space is it's kind of hard to get in it unless you buy a ladder. And that shit's like $40 on Amazon, so you know that's not worth it. 
So this is the real way to do it. Oh, gee, you just like, wanna, this is the just college. Climb up into your bed. Dude, that was actually kind of seamless. This is the college grind. Yeah. You, know? you wake up, you bang your head on the top of the wall. The college grind is all here. We got this at the local Korean Mart. Um, this is like an instant ramen maker. It's super thick. Even if it's not like for instant ramen, you can boil water in here. You can make instant coffee, tea, anything you need late at night. You don't even have to leave your dorm room. You just go to the water fountain down the hall. <laughs> Alright guys, that about wraps it up for this video. I hope that this was helpful to get an idea of what a dorm room looks like, especially at Northwestern. Once again, this is something that I wish I knew when I was applying to these schools. It's really hard to get an idea of what a dorm room can look like, especially from the website. So, huge shout out to my boy June for doing this. Guys, I will have his Instagram link down below. Plug my boy Hamza on Spotify, SoundCloud. We sell beats. If you're an artist looking for beats, we got you. That's facts. Father's Day is coming right around the corner, so if you guys are looking for a great gift to get your dad, I highly recommend checking out Wool's Gold and Black. They have super stylish stuff for older guys as well. Their beaded bracelets are a great addition to any guy's wardrobe. So if you haven't already, I will have them linked up below. Subscribe for more videos and let's build. You, Drake, up all my liquor, come on. What I'm supposed to do now? Huh, and you